Hello and welcome back to Colford Plays Indivisible. Last we left off, we made it out of the ruins, defeated the giant spider monster, and we got a bowl of noodles here, some stir fry, so you might be enjoying those while we play. We went to my favorite Chinese place the other day, and uh, not my favorite, but my old favorite Chinese place. All right, we've cleared the oh, we ruins. cleared the ruins. Thanks for your help, Rosmi. Ginseng, do either of you have anywhere you want to go? I've got to go smash up Dar's boss. No plans. Let's do the smashing thing. That sounds good. We still want to travel the world with you. Even if your objective is a little gruesome. <laughs> wow! That's great! Then we'll all go together! Halt! No one from Ashwat Village may leave. Uh-oh. Soldiers, as a lieutenant of the Navarre army, I command you to escort this child to Vimana Fortress for interrogation. Yes, sir. I am Ashna, daughter of Inder, chief of Ashwat Village, and I will not go quietly. Don't kill her. I need to bring her to Lord Ravanavar alive. Yes, sir. What just happened? Did we get captured? That was pretty sudden. Oh god. Ah, uh, my head. Finally, you're up. I don't know why they put me in here with you. I explained that I was bringing you to Lord Ravanavar, but they wouldn't listen to my orders. Maybe that's because you're a jerk and nobody likes you. Oh shit. She makes a good point. Now, now, let's not fight one another. If I could just speak directly to Lord Ravanavar. Not to worry. We're going straight to him. And how do you plan to do that? Walk through the walls? There's gotta be a way out of here. There's a way out of everywhere. No one has ever escaped this prison, and you won't be the first. There are only two ways out. The doors and the air vents. Oh, if only you had your axe, Ajna. My soldiers are too thorough. They wouldn't be so foolish as to leave you with a weapon. They can't take your weapon if you store it in your brain. Oh, right you are. Now let's get out of here. Get ready, door. The doors are quite solid, I assure you. Right, air vents. <laughs> Who leaves a giant open hole in their prison? Normally, our prisoners aren't carrying magic axes around in their mysterious inner realms. <laughs> Gotta be prepared for everything, Dar. Howdy. Ah, how'd they find us so fast? Dar? I didn't call them, but I'm glad they're here. Soldiers, take us to Lord Ravanavar immediately. Our orders are to detain the girl. Nothing more. This is insubordination. I am your superior officer. <laughs> We're gonna get murdered. <laughs> Not if I can help it. They should be good practice. Blue aura. <laughs> Breakthrough in enemy's defense. Up attack followed by down attack or vice versa. Off. Next. 
Nice. Level up. God dead. Save guy. A window. We can escape through there. I'm gonna smash it. Wait, you fool! Don't listen to Majna. Kill that window. Kill it. I'm gonna. <laughs> Oh, how, God. How high up are we? This is why I said to wait. Wow, the clouds are below us. What is this place? Fortress Vimana. This is Vimana, Lord Ravanovar's flying fortress. It brings our soldiers wherever they are needed. That means Ravanovar is in here? Somewhere inside this thing? He is, but you won't get to him easily. We'll see about that. I'll tear this fortress apart by hand if I have to. Or burn it. We could burn it. We'll figure that out when the time comes. But first, we've got to get back inside. You there? Yes. Oh, another prisoner? Only temporarily, I assure you. The great Zebe cannot be caged for long. Why don't he just climb out through the air vent? That's what I did. I've tried, of course. I can't make it to the entrance. In that Ravanovar. Keeping freedom always within sight, but just out of reach. Oh, so that's what that was supposed to do. They mean to break my spirit. But if they think they've heard the last of Zebe, they've got another thing coming. They should have killed me while they had the chance. Yeah, you tell him. So how about it? Get me out of here, will you? He is in prison for a reason, Ajna. And he is a little scary. I've seen scarier. I don't pay attention to them. Listen, I heard a bit of what you were talking about before. You're trying to take down Ravanovar, right? Yeah, I'm gonna chop him up. Not without my help. He's incredibly strong, but if you get me out of here, it'll be like you let an army loose in his fortress. He won't know what hit him. Ooh, that sounds good. Nonsense. He's a criminal. We're getting you out of there, Zebe. But you'd better be as great as you say. You will? Just like that? I mean, <laughs> of course I am. <laughs> You'll see soon enough. We'll be back. <laughs> I'll just hold down the fort in here for now. Yeah, hold it down. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
Ya ve ahí. So it looks like there's a boss coming up. So before we do that... We're going to save here. I'm going to call that a video. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode of Colford Plays Indivisible, please remember to comment, like, subscribe in the YouTube section down below. It means a lot for the video, helps us grow. Other than that, you have a great rest of your day, man, woman, whoever you are. Be yourself, have fun, I love you. Take care, bye-bye.